motive and means. And no one's gonna save him. This hearing is in session. Mr. Manning, I cannot tell you how sorry I am to see you in my courtroom again. However, you will feel sorrier once your pardon is rescinded. With all due respect, Your Honor, that remains to be seen. Until and unless the people can prove Excuse beyond a... Excuse me? I went to law school. Ms. Mitchell, Mr. Gannon. Can you prove this case? Can and will, Your Honor. Todd Manning is a repeat offender. We can prove it beyond the shadow of a doubt. What happened to innocent until proven guilty? Excuse me? Your client will have justice here. However, I will not allow him nor you to waste the court's time nor money engaging in legal shenanigans. I went through that the last time when Nora Gannon led the defense. Once was enough. What are you suggesting, Your Honor? For all concerned, including your client, don't you think it's best if he plead guilty? But, Your Honor, my client insists that he's innocent. I don't care what your client insists, Counselor. You tell him for me. If he pleads not guilty and the evidence proves otherwise, this court will come down on him like a, like a hard rain in November, without mercy. Do I make myself clear? He was with you at the hospital at 11 p.m. last night, the same exact time Rebecca was attacked. Yeah, well, Todd says a lot of things. Even Todd can't be two places at one time, Mark. Oh, but that's assuming you believe him. Well, I do. Well, that's your problem. Good night, Rebecca. No, 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 no. That is your problem, Marty. According to Todd's attorney, you won't even back up his alibi. Because it's not true. You see, I think it is. And I think you are lying. Now, either you go to the police and tell the truth right now, or... Well, don't stop there, or what? No, let me guess. You'll start spreading lies about Andrew and me all over town. That does sound like you. <laughs> you see, unlike you, I don't have to live for revenge. I learned the hard way what bitterness and hate can do. Come on, Marty. Don't make my mistakes. You know that Todd is innocent, and you know what you have to do. Yeah, I'm gonna get a lesson from you, of all people. Blair Dame was gonna tell me how to live my life. You're right. I know, I know what I have to do. I should have done a long time ago. Put Todd back where he belongs. Make sure he never... Do the right thing by your client, Ms. Mitchell. You and Mr. Gannon do a deal. So what was that all about, what you say? Todd, listen to me. Without Marty Sabrick's story, you have no one to back up your all alibi. All I have is the truth. Listen, if you plead not guilty, Hank will nail you to the wall and Judge Fitzwater will hand him the hammer. What are you trying to tell me here, Allie? What any good lawyer would tell you. Plead guilty and I'll bargain for a reduced sentence. I'm sorry, Todd, but it's your only hope. I don't care if this judge hates my guts. I'm not going to plead guilty to a crime I didn't commit. And I did not try and rape Rebecca. Mr. Manning? Stand and face the court. Remind me to hire a guy next time. Todd Manning, you are charged with the attempted rape of Rebecca Lewis. How do you plead? I'm not guilty. I plead not guilty. It's like he's asking for it. <laughs> well, let's give it to him. Let the uh, record note that the defendant issues a plea of not guilty. 
Trial is set for... Sorry, Judge, a week isn't nearly enough time for us to prepare a proper defense. It's seven more days than I wish to give him. Your client has wasted enough of the people's time and money with his contemptuous past performances. If he attempts a repeat performance of his last trial, I guarantee that this court will put a restraint on him. Silence. Do I make myself clear? What about my bail? <laughs> you have a history of fleeing the county. Bail is denied. This hearing is adjourned. You know, you guys think you've got me all figured out. Well, there's something you didn't figure. Marty's lying. She was with me at 11 o'clock that night. Let's go. I'm innocent. Marty Saybrook knows that. Well, actually, I've tried to help someone out of it. And were you able to help to someone? I don't think so. And now he's going to pay for something that he didn't do, and it's unfair. You sound pretty intent on helping this someone. Do I know who he is? Mm -hmm. Who is the guy? Todd Manning. Todd? Isn't he in jail? He's in jail for the attempted rape of Rebecca Lewis, and I was just with him an hour ago. You went to see Todd in jail? Well, I, I didn't plan on it. The police called me in for questioning. Look, Larry, if Todd is guilty Look, of his crime... I had to find out for myself, Cord. Todd told me that he would never hurt Rebecca because she's the only woman he's ever loved, and I believe him. And I... I feel sorry for him. Blair... Look, he has made some mistakes. I know that, and he's hurt a lot of people. I know that, too, but that doesn't mean that this time that he's guilty. He might be innocent. Todd Manning isn't the only one you're talking about here, is he? I guess not. Listen, I can understand you wanting to feel so sympathetic towards him. But you really shouldn't compare yourself to him, because there is no comparison. We are not all that different. Court, we're not. Except for one thing. Todd doesn't have anyone who believes in him like I do. I have you. So... Too much.